You know, in any business, you have cyclicalness, you have the ups and downs relative to whether the airlines are hiring, whether the charter companies are hiring. But at the end of the day, as you look at the longer curve to that, there's going to be a strong demand uh, for professional pilots, not only here domestically in the United States, but also around the globe, particularly in countries that are emerging countries that are growing economically. I think that this, the maneuverability, the stability, and the, and the cockpit layout of the Mentor makes a very, very strong, young, fresh, new pilot because they must learn how to fly. They have to keep their scans moving, they have to keep their hands moving, they have to be able to connect to the airplane in ways that some of our legacy aircraft just don't require. From zero to a commercial pilot, get them a degree, get them a job in the airlines and show them the pathway to get there. We're at A.L. Mangan Jr. Regional Airport uh, here in Nacogdoches in East Texas. This airport's been around coming up on 100 years uh, and it's, it's got a rich history. The Civil Air Patrol headquarters is, is still here. So HCH Aviation was formed about five years ago to address a need here in the area. We jointly with the university created a 141 professional flight training program. The students get ground instruction at the university and they come to us for their flight labs. It was actually uh, through some resources with the government, put us in contact with Technum, reached out directly to Technum leadership in Italy. And then I met a, a gentleman named Shannon Yeager who worked for Technum USA. And he brought a Technum twin for me to look at and to fly and I fell in love with the product. We have three, three different type of Technum aircraft. We have uh, four of the SLA Sierras. Uh, we have C6P Mentors and two 2006 Twins. I started to learn more about the, the, the company, that they are the oldest aircraft manufacturer on the planet, which that's encouraging to me. I like the P Mentor a lot. I think the avionics package is like really of the times. I think it's good for the students to get involved with advanced avionics early. I think that's a good thing for them. Burn about four or five gallons an hour, whereas your standard legacy aircraft is, is burning 20 to 30 percent more than that. Yeah, it is quiet. Uh, I have like noise canceling headphones and you don't really need that. It makes it really, really quiet when you do have all those together. The cockpit layout that we currently have is absolutely perfect for us in the way that we train our crew flight. My name is Josie Ojeski. Uh, I'm a sophomore at SFA right now. I decided I wouldn't be in aviation probably about three months before I actually applied, and then I found that this school had a program that was uh, part 141 so I could do college and I could do this. No, it's a passion. Uh, sometimes it can feel like a job when you get on your fourth flight of the day and you're like I kind of want to, you know, I'm tired. But it's always it's fun. I like being here. When I still fly V-22 Ospreys and I have a special love for, uh, for the Technum aircraft because they have a stick in them just like all the aircraft I'm used to in the military. I actually, I kind of like it better. It's a lot, it's stable, more reliable. The Rotax engine is a fantastic engine. Cost of running a Rotax engine compared to the Lycoming engine, based on the performance that the airplane will give back, the Rotax wins all day long. It's fun to see the reward of pe people figuring out the airplane and, you know, the smile when they do their first landing. I like it. It's, it's amazing to be able to offer that to students and even better to, to see that twinkle in their eye and see that passion like you mentioned. We were having a hard time getting aircraft. We had partnered with some other aircraft manufacturers. The lead time to get to a size of fleet that we needed uh, was going to take years, and we didn't have years. Technum uh, Open Arms said, you know, we want to be your partner, and we want to help you grow. Technum's done that every step of the way so far. Uh, and the service that we've got from the Technum team uh, in Italy and U.S. base has been incredible. You know, anytime we've had any issue arise, They've been able to help us out. Technum was trying to, to bring us quality and something new, doing things much more innovative than anybody else. Yeah.